Okay, hi guys, my name is Evelyn, and you know, I was, I have writer's block, or I had writer's block, and so I was on YouTube, and I thought, oh, I should look up how to get rid of writer's block, so I did, and there's not that many videos out there, and so I thought that maybe I should make a video. I found some helpful ones, which were really nice, so I'm here to help you guys today, because I'm sure a lot of you love to write, you're writing your own novels, or your poems, or your own songs, and you're at that point where you're writing, you're writing, you're so it's so great. You read it over and over again, and then boom, you stop because you're like, what do I write now? I just finished this great thing, this great piece of writing, and now uh, I'm stuck, right? So, going to help you out a little bit because I just got out of my writer's block. What I was doing was I was outside. I was outside of my house trying to get some inspiration or whatever. And I was watching this little girl ride her bike. Well, while she was riding her bike, she fell off of it. And she's only like six or seven years old. So I was like, oh, she fell off. She scraped her knee and she was crying. And that made me remember, that made me think of, sorry, that when I was a little girl, how I would ride my bike and how when I used to fall, when I used to cry. And it made me think of pain. Then I, her brother came out and helped her up and picked her up and brought her inside. And I thought, huh, you know pain someone there to help you and my dog had ran away earlier today don't worry we found her uh yeah she came back I'm thankful for that but so i was thinking something you love getting away from you pain someone there helping you and it got me out of my writer's block so what i'm just going to tell you is some few tips like i was walking around the entire house Look, uh, trying to find some inspiration to get rid of my writer's block. I'm on the floor in my brother's room right now. Because I, I went into every room. <laughs> Look. A ferret. Okay. Anyways. So. Okay. Number one. When you have writer's block, leave what you're doing and go do something else. Get distracted. Go listen to music. Go watch a, a, like half an hour of TV. Go just... For, leave your story or your song or whatever it is there for a little bit and go distract yourself because when you distract yourself your mind gets out of that phase of oh I need to think of what to write so just do that two what if two of the best words out there that start any story what if this happened what if she got eaten by an alien what if you know what if everything turn to dust and you were the last I don't know just something what if whatever it is what if this what if that because that gets the brain going it starts getting you thinking don't forget those two words because they are really important in writing it starts every story your mind that's how it that's how yeah sorry I messed up in my sentence anyways um what else you can do is if you don't want to leave your work Continue writing. Just continue writing and writing. Don't stop yourself. Don't think about it. Don't edit your own stuff. Because editing is what stops you. Because if you're writing and writing, think, oh, I don't like that, and then erase, that's what gets you into a writer's block. So don't edit. Just write and write and write, even if it's something weird or bizarre. And then when you're done, then you could look back at it and edit it and see, take out what you don't want in there and all this stuff. So, yeah. I hope you... I, ugh, oh, I need to go now. I hope this helped you guys. So, yep. Good luck with your writing.